Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you can see by this title, I'm going to be telling you guys all about my hair and what I use in my hair. So if you like to know more about that, please continue to this video. So about my hair, I have been natural for about nine months now. I cut off all of my dead ends in on December 4th. 2018 so it's going to be a year soon I'm very excited I have come a long way with my hair ever since I was about nine ten years old my hair has been something so much for me but now I'm really happy I love how much I have grown my hair my hair has grown a lot and I'm very very happy with this progress that I'm going through so first thing is I learned that shampooing my hair or any hair for our type of hair is very very like something different i don't shampoo my hair every wash day i don't it dries out my hair a lot it makes any like the rest of the day my hair is like in a complete mess so now i only like wash my hair once or twice a month depending on how much buildup that I have but when I do wash my hair wash my hair I use the Garnade Whole Blend Smoothing Shampoo with coconut oil and cocoa butter it looks like this you can get it at any Walmart CVS stores that you have it smells amazing and it really does clean my hair when I need it to and that's amazing oh, you guys are thinking what I use instead of shampoo what do I use I use a co-wash and a co-wash is very great you should, you should totally get a co-wash it doesn't matter what type of co-wash you get just have something that's a co-wash that can actually clean your hair on the days you want to just wash your hair and the co-wash that I use is from Jane Carter Solution Curls to Go and is a curl drench cleansing co-wash and is sulfate free you can also get this at a, any beauty supply stores that you know of it is really good it smells amazing it smells amazing and it really just get those products out of my hair on the days i wash my hair i usually wash my hair twice a week depending or i just usually wash it once a week um, I don't really do that much because I do really go for a wash and go. That way the wash and go can last me to about three to four days. So that's why it depends on two to three days depending because not every wash and go that I do goes out perfect. It never goes out the same way as always. So for my condition now, I use the Garnet Whole Grains, the same one as the shampoo. And I use this one. I use this after I use my co wash every wash day. This is my lifesaver. It's so easy for me to use and for me to detangle my hair with. I just love it so much. Next thing is, I also deep condition twice a week. Deep conditioning your hair is the best thing ever. Like, no lie, it's the best thing ever. It really makes your hair feel super soft. It keeps in your moisture and really does good for your hair because deconditioning, you're bringing back the oils after you're cleansing your hair so much. You're bringing back the natural oil and it's refreshing your curls. So the deep conditioner that I'm using is the Hydrate and, Prote Hydrate and Repair Protein Power Treatment. This is from Sheer Moisture. You can get this at any beauty supply store in Walmart or online at Ulta Beauty. I use this because right now, since I colored my hair like a couple months ago or a month ago, my hair has been really, really dry and the deep condition that I was using for wasn't working for me. So I needed something to help repair my hair because it was dry my curls weren't curling again but since i've been using it now my curls have been back to its original place where it was before and it's a little bit more curlier and 
more softer than before so after the shower now i do recommend you to get invest invest i tell you invest into a good leave-in condition and a leave-in condition is for me i use the garnet fruits it's the sleek and shy intense and smooth leave-in conditioning cream it's for frizzy dry hair and this is what it looks like I love this so much it smells so great and it really melts into my hair it really does melt into my hair so for my moisturizer okay this is a combination in this bottle actually I have Jamaican castor oil I have olive oil and I have a the Cantu moisturizer in it and this I just mix them all together in this bottle and it's been doing justice so this is a mixture of different little things so just even if you have to mix moisturizers together to make it work for your hair or you just use one moisturizer this is what I use this is super great so this is like the Cantoon bottle but I'll, I added olive oil my Jamaican castor oil in it because Jamaican castor oil guys it is so good I use it every day even at night when I'm wrapping my hair I just take a little bit in my hand rub it all through my hair and then wrap my hair up so the next day my curls are still have moisture in it and it looks a little bit more fresh and not dry and brittle and another thing that I have been using now is the Diva Curl Super Cream Define and Control. This is what I use to also help make my hair very defined. It's super, super big. It's a creamy material. It's like, no, it's a very creamy consistency, but it doesn't feel thick or weighted down on your hair. The gel that I use in my hair is the extreme wet line gel it doesn't it doesn't matter if it's the blue or white one but this gel is my go-to for my wash and go it's literally amazing but i just started using the blue kind i always stick to the clear one but i think i'm gonna go back to the clear one because the blue kind is kind of leaving like i don't know Kind of leaving its blueness behind <laughs> in my hair but yeah but this extreme wet line gel is super super good it works for my hair i tried different gel i tried the aunt jackie gel the cream gel and i even tried the eco style gel because everybody start using the eco style gel for wash and go they don't work for me i don't know what am i doing wrong but i tried it i tried all of the same thing i do to get to get that defining for the eco style gel but it doesn't work for my hair it always makes my hair feel super dry super flaky the next day and i don't know maybe one day i will try again with the eco style gel but at this moment the extreme wet line is all i'm gonna use and if it's worked for my hair i'm not leaving it until I do come across a different method or a different gel. Right now, these are the products. What I'm showing you is what I'm sticking to, what is working for me, until something else happened that I will change it up a bit or if I wanna try something new. Well, that is it for today's video. That's all I use in my hair. If you guys want more hair videos, please tell me down in the comments below. And I'll see you in my next video. So please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos. And I'll see you guys next time.